you guys doing? Thanks for joining me. All right, what I'm gonna try and do right here now is uh, point things out so that it can be clear for the people that keep giving me the messages that I need to be clear about the Saturn worship that everybody does. Let's uh, take a close look here. You have your wedding ring that you put on. That's the Lord of the Rings. You are 100% satanic if you put your wedding ring on, okay? That's uh, your Nike. That's also the Intel logo. That's everything with the ring. You'll see Saturn is on everything. Now, Saturn, said in Latin, is Satan, represented by this black cube that you go around in Mecca, that you go counterclockwise around. Now, Jewish people put it on their head. It's called the Teflon. And if you unfold this, you, it only unfolds one way, and that's into your Jesus cross. And you put that cube on your head when you graduate. The cross is on everything. You, you can't escape it. It's that the cube is on everything that you touch. It's everything. Saturn, here, it's your ego waffle. It's that the ring is on everything. You are 100% satanic. You're in your carbon 666 flesh pack. You have a reptilian core to your brain. It's responsible for fight or flight. You are a reptilian hybrid. You can't detect this, but the Pac-Man moon that they've rubbed in your face, okay, that they offer you a light at death and you'll walk into the light and you'll be recycled. Understand what's happened here. You live on a flat earth plane. You're a two-dimensional hologram and you can't detect it. See, what they've done is they've destroyed this planet Maldek, or some people call it Tiamat, that was now, that's now the asteroid belt. And they scooped up all the souls that were floating around, all right? And they deposited here on this piece, which is a flat earth plane. And you know how they make holograms by applying two lasers onto the same object so it gets an interference pattern? Here what you've got is that you've got us in a holographic situation. The earth has been cubed. You are a cyborg now. You, uh, as soon as they gave you time, you became a slave and you can't detect it. What they've done is they've literally trapped your star that was floating around in space. They've erased your memory like they do when you get when you die and you go into the light. They recycle you and they erase your memory and place you back into an embryo. Listen to me, people. This is real shit. You need to wake the fuck up, okay? You're a star at your heart. You've been cubed, okay? Your kundalini is a trap. You're a free energy machine and you can't detect it. Now you're forced to take a shit, get horny, get hungry, get a pain in your heart, a frog in your throat. Your feet where your souls are, okay? Um, two below you, three above you. Listen, you could put this shit together, people. They rub a lot of stuff in your face. It's called lesser magic. It takes your blood off of their hands. All right? You've been worshiping Saturn along with everybody else. You take your energy from the one true sun and plant an animal, and then you feed it directly to the black hole sun. That's all you do, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You breathe Satan's chemical air. You drink his fluoridated water. You eat his poison and rich foods. And when I say Satan, I mean Saturn. Saturn is obviously there's a cult on Earth, and they've got us all worshiping Saturn. Uh, people describe it as you were born into sign, not sin. If you look at the abbreviation for sign, S-I-N-E, you'll see it's S-I-N. You were born into sign, and, and uh, you've been squared. You put that cube on your head when you're graduating. Listen, your kids go from cube to cube to cube. They rub Saturn in your face. Look, it's on everything. You see Saturn right there. You see that it's the one eye. That's the south pole of Saturn. All right, everybody's a reptile. Look, it's on Thomas the Train. It's that your Lego cubes. Look, everybody worships the sun, whether you guys worship the black hole sun. See, they put a star on everything. It's your military. And this is how they think of you. They think of you as dumb, hick, stupid people. You're just, you, you worship, uh, look, Halloween. You said your kids have to get candy. Look up the truth behind Halloween and everything. Look, people, they rub the shit in your face. It's, a, it's Saturn worship is what everybody does. Now, the internet is the new world order itself, and if you're watching me, you're 100% satanic. You speak Satan's uh, black magic spells that I reverse to expose your lies. Uh, Dr. David John Oates got a Nobel laureate, uh, or he was a runner-up, um, showing that reverse speech is always truthful. Look, Saturn's on everything. See, they got the ring of Saturn. It's your Nike. It's that you can't escape it, people. Everybody, look, they put it on your, on your, the black hole sun. You give your, you take your energy from the one true sun and plant and animal, and you feed it to the black hole sun. Look, this is the symbol of your police. This is, they rub this shit in your face, people. And aliens, look, they rub it in your face, the cube. So aliens hijacked Saturn, which is a protostar, and they also hijacked Jupiter. And Zeus, they go back and forth, passing this cube, the time cube, which keeps you trapped into this illusion. Now, what you need to do, people, is unite peacefully out of love for each other in a common cause of survival. It's that all you do 
is take your energy from the one true sun and plant and animal and you feed it to the black hole sun. When you, you think your kids are going off to school to get an education, no, they're not. Just like you, you're going to put a cube on your head when you graduate, showing that you've been indoctrinated. You were fed the reverse of truth in all things. If you look at what the first atom that they ever snapped a picture of and you look at it, it looks exactly like Saturn. It looks, I'm telling you, you've never even seen what an atom looks like until you look up the real images of the first atom ever captured. It looks like Saturn. It's a, the inescapable. Now listen, your body is made up of cells. You understand me? You're trapped cell by cell. When a cell falls off your body and dies, that cell will go back to the center, the source of you. You where your heart is, where there's a singularity. You're a singularity at heart, and they're drawing all your energy out of you. Your pineal gland, you can... Listen, I've been sun gazing and earthing for quite some time, and I'm telling you, you become superhuman. You get to see all different types of things that you can't see. I'm telling you that your kundalini is a trap. You've been cubed. Your eye of Horus is, is, this, is your third eye, which is your Satan porthole. And when you open that thing up, you get pulled into a trap. I'm telling you, you need to get back to your heart by doing selfless acts of kindness and you could do earthing by putting your feet into the sand, okay? Uh, I'm sorry, not the sand, in dry soil. It's got to be dry soil, non-conductive soil. And you walk 45 minutes a day, five to six days a week is the greatest health discovery. Now, you could look up earthing mat online and you can get an earthing mat to sleep on in case you can't get out and do the, the earthing. And after a month of doing that, then look into sun gazing where you'll stare at the sun for 10 seconds your first day only, barefoot on soil. You'll go to 20 seconds the next day and work up 10 seconds a day up to 44 minutes and then you'll switch to 10 minutes three times a week and you'll always continue on with your sun gazing. So listen to me, people. They rub this shit in your face nonstop. That's the South Pole. Okay, it's on your money. South Pole Saturn. It's in every show you watch. It's literally everything. You're a robot. This is you. You're the robot, people. You can't detect it. But you are the robot and you are the hybrid reptilian. This is you. You're a hybrid reptilian. You can't detect it. You have a reptilian core to your brain. It's responsible for fight or flight. And if you zoom in on a lot of photos of people, you'll notice that most everybody has one snake slit eye in photos that you zoom in on. But listen to me, people. You need to unite peacefully out of love for each other and a common cause of survival. You speak black magic spells over use of telepathy. It's reduced your brain down to 10% capacity. Language is a virus. Okay? You've been... The reptilians came from the dog star Sirius. You reversed God and you have dog. Now listen, people. You're the one who's creating out of love or fear. You put your feet on the ground in the morning, you create for love or fear. That's all you do. It's that you're the creator. It's one electron universe. We're all in a hologram right now. And there's only one electron in the whole entire universe that you're in. Now, this is a little piece of... of uh, the real universe you're not allowed to see that's outside of this. Everything, you're in a, you're like on, if, when they see Earth from outside of Earth, it looks like a two-dimensional screen, like an LCD screen. You've been cubed, people. It's that you go from cube to cube to cube. That's all you do all day is cube to cube worship. And you have God virus, you place the power of creation outside of you. You have gold fever virus, you let people die over not having enough worthless paper backed by your, your own stupidity. It's not backed by gold since 1933. And when the Fed took over the money in 1913, listen, people, you you became a slave. You're now sold on the stock exchange. Everything you know is the reverse of truth. You were never given a single truth. Jesus is Latin for little Zeus, which is Saturn. Saturn is who you're worshiping. Saturn said in Latin is Satan. Everybody worships Satan. You have purple. That's why they were purple. It's the sign. You mix red and blue together. That's the sine wave. You were born into sign. You mix them together. You have the purple. You've been cubed. You've been cubed. They've, they've taken, they've hijacked you, and now everybody is cubed to cube to cube. I don't care if you're playing with a dreidel. You've been Borg assimilated, people. That's what these symbols mean. You've been Borg assimilated. You can't detect it, but you live on a flat earth plane. Look at the United Nations flag. It's the flat earth map. Use a sextant like me and my son did to determine the diameter of the sun. It's 32 miles nautical miles across, and it's 3,100 miles away. I don't care if you look at an airplane window. You'll notice that the horizon is eye level. It's also eye level if you're sitting on the beach, and this is mathematically impossible. You can't detect it, but you live on a flat Earth plane. You're caught in a, a Saturn moon matrix hologram, and you're being recycled over and over and over. You're a silly reptilian human hybrid slave, and you go cube to ring, cube to ring. You are 100% satanic, and you deny it. It's that everything you read, it's rubbed in your face, it's cubes everywhere. Everything is cubes, reptilians and cubes. You are a silly human slave. You need to unite peacefully. 
Now listen, you speak black magic spells over use of telepathy. You want to help free the world and usher in heaven on earth? Then spill your blood over your intent like I showed you in my video. Where you put down on paper, I intend to worship all and I intend to usher in heaven on earth. And make sure you're videotaping this and then prick your finger and put some blood on it. And now publish that to your channel. It doesn't even have your face in it. When enough of us step up to decide we're going to usher in heaven on earth, guess what? Heaven is coming to earth and nobody can stop it. And all you have to do is point your video on your, on your channel like I showed you. And you'll know who's in the club. It's very simple, people. And you need to start uniting peacefully out of love for each other and a common cause of survival. Is that your weapons will only feed their agenda. And you don't need weapons. We're the, we're the big bully on the block, people. You don't need weapons. And whoever told you you need weapons to win this next one, you're crazy. It's that they'll all bury themselves underground, shut off the power, and let us all kill each other. That's what they'll do. You're that dumb. And you think that any of the shit they show you on TV is real. It's all a hoax and a lie, people. You need to see my channel for Truth the Media immediately.